Preform does at the lab here is we actually conduct tests on our products to make sure that they work for applications out there in the field. The laboratory is really an important part of our whole development cycle. The products and ideas that, that we come up with for our customers have to meet our own um, internal POP standards, industry standards, and the customer standards. Simulate uh, the dynamics that take place on uh, cables as a result of um, you know wind-induced motions and oscillations and the things that you know really fundamentally take place uh, by our environment whether it's in our vibration locations our tensile testing or perhaps even in the environmental area because of the effects of uh, salt fog or UV. As the products are, go through their life cycle they'll see all types of environmental problems and issues due to wind, rain, storms and uh, we try to simulate as much of that as possible. When you choose a preform product, you're going to know that there's a lot of testing and a lot of analytics behind it. We have a dedicated facility that's uh, safe to do high voltage testing 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Not only data acquisition, but then the history of the data that we have and the experiences that PLP has since 1947 with these products in the field. So we're able to build on all those experiences so we have to simulate all those tests in our laboratory to give us confidence the products that we supply today will last for 30 years in the field. That's our goal. The standards that we developed here at Preform Line Products were developed in Cleveland, Ohio. What we do best, I think, is really focusing on the ability to simulate what takes place out in the field with these products and these technologies and bring that into the lab and simulate that to the point where we are assured that we know what this thing is going to see and we can duplicate that and then engineer the best products. This is another higher level of quality assurance that PLP is able to do as a result of this laboratory.